I wish more people understood this about the Plaza Inn in Disneyland. And no, this isn't about Walt's hideout and how it was a precursor to Club 33 because we've already talked about that. So to tell the story, we have to go back in time a little bit to when this restaurant was called the Red Wagon Inn, which is of course why the corn dog cart is called this. Anyway, Disney bought this mansion in LA and took pieces of it for the Red Wagon Inn, like this stained glass ceiling, some chandeliers, most of the foyer in the front, and of course the front doors. The restaurant was sponsored by Swift until Disney decided he wanted to manage all the restaurants in Disneyland himself. So he decided to renovate the Plaza Inn and make it a little bit more extravagant, to the tune of a $1.7 million renovation. And truly, he spared no expense. He said to Emil Curie, the average factory worker or truck driver can't afford luxury for himself or his family, so I want you to make the interior really luxurious. Even our prices are going to be cafeteria prices. So the Plaza Inn was Walt's way of making luxury affordable for everyone.